Hi everybody, Doug Miles along with Ed Schneider. We're coming to you tonight from the ESPN Wide World of Sports at Disney World. We saw a very entertaining game tonight between the Cathedral Prep Ramblers and the Wakula War Eagles. The War Eagles come out with a 31-14 to win. And uh, what makes it special tonight, it's uh, my color man, Eddie's alma mater. So you got a chance for your alma mater tonight. Yeah, right? it, was, it was great to uh, be able to see the, the Ramblers down here in Florida uh, make the long trip from Pennsylvania. Uh, they acquitted themselves well. Uh, we knew they were a young team. Uh, a lot of young players getting their first uh, varsity starts tonight. And uh, even though uh, they fell behind 25-7 to seven, uh, in the third quarter, they battled back, uh, made a couple big plays to make it 25-14, had a chance uh, midway through the fourth quarter to drive down and make it a one-score game. Uh, but an unfortunate uh, uh, big hit and a carom that turned into an interception thwarted that drive. Uh, and Wakala was able to drive it down for one last score, uh, separating themselves from uh, the Prep Ramblers with a final of 31-14. We got to see one of the top high school quarterbacks in the country who a lot of people saw last week on ESPNU for uh, Wakala in uh, Franks, who uh, had a pretty good game tonight. Last week he was kind of shaky, but I uh, thought he played pretty well tonight. Well, the, the Ramblers did hit him in the mouth uh, early in the game, and uh, you could tell he didn't like it, but uh, he bounced back. I'll give him credit there. Uh, and if he had some time, he was able to put the ball uh, in some spots where his receivers were able to do something with it. Uh, Wakala has a bevy of uh, fast, wide receivers and running backs, uh, and uh, they took full advantage of all of them uh, tonight to give the Ramblers credit uh, for holding that high-powered Wakala offense to only 31 points. Yeah, three touchdown passes tonight and a couple of running touchdowns uh, also for uh, Loggins for Wakala and uh, the touchdowns for uh, Cathedral Prep, uh, Maloney Jones, and then uh, late in the game, uh, there was one by again by Jones. So he had a good game tonight for Prep. Yeah, Jones did well in his first start at uh, uh, in the backfield for the Ramblers, and uh, that's uh, one spot where they lost the most experience. And uh, so I say overall, uh, him and I like the job Pagurski did in there as well, and Kalashevsky. Uh, you know, some of those guys uh, really stepped up, and uh, nobody they certainly didn't back down. From Wakala, and I was proud of the way that the uh, Prep Ramblers hung in there tonight. They didn't come away with a victory, but it is a uh, uh, certainly uh, uh, something to say for the uh, Rambler uh, program and coached by Mitchler. And we had a chance to simulcast the game back up to Erie, Pennsylvania, and WJET Radio. So I'd like to uh, thank uh, the folks up there for that as well. I know we had a lot of uh, people watching and uh, listening to our broadcast tonight from Pennsylvania. But the next week, Ed, we're going to be back on our usual schedule. Sarasota Manatee will have a good one from one of our favorite places, Eric Field at Sarasota High School, Island Coast, playing the Sailors. Probably our uh, favorite uh, press box. Uh, that's why we love to go back there so often. Uh, but, they always uh, have a booth for us. Uh, they always save a spot for us, a nice spot for us, and good air conditioning, important here in Florida. <laughs> uh, even though we were in the open air tonight, Doug, uh, the weather cooperated. Uh, really wasn't uh, overly hot or anything, and the rain held off. So uh, all in all, a pretty good experience here at the Wide World of Sports at Disney. Uh, even though the Ramblers came away with a loss, I think it was a great experience for everybody. Final score once again from Disney's ESPN Wide World of Sports. The Wakulla War Eagles 31, the Cathedral Prep Ramblers 14. For Ed Schneider, this is Doug Miles saying thanks for watching. We'll see you again real soon on our post-game show from Sarasota. Good night.